We play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome back to the Preak Show, where our one rule is never leave home without your bard. I am your host today, Bumpy Squiggums. We're back in Scarab Bray, the Bard Tale trilogy, and yeah, the Bard's Tale one. Let's uh, let's level up. Let's see what we get. Advancement, Brian the Feast. 15 hit points, it's incredible. One to attack, one to dexterity. Very nice. 10, that's pretty good. Hit points, uh, one to dexterity. Come on, Marcus. 11 hit points, I'll take it. Uh, push the him on up to 77. That's very, very nice. And Sar Grady, uh, four hit points. Well, Hide and Shadows goes up, Identify goes up. That's uh, good. Uh, I believe we're going to have new spells again, maybe? Maybe not. Maybe it's the next level. Nope, it's this level. Four hit points, six spell points, and one to constitution, and two hit points, five spell points, and one to intelligence. Okay. That's not too bad. Um, I am going to assume spells now might be, was it 4k last time? So is it eight? I have no idea. Was it 2k? I, I don't, I don't remember. Uh, Merlin. 7,000. All right, well, there you go. Greater Revelation. It's like lesser, only illuminates a wider area. Interesting. A large globe of intense electrical energy envelops a group of enemies doing 10 to 50 points of damage. That's very incredible. Uh, makes a member of your party fight with the strength and accuracy of ancient Norse heroes for the entire combat. Okay. Yep, we'll grab it. And... Spell acquisition for Omar. Acres animated sword. A magical sword will appear and fight like a summoned monster in defense of the party. That sounds pretty useful. We have anti-magic. Causes the ground to absorb a portion of the magical energies cast at the party. Frequently allowing the members to escape all damage. Also aids in disbelieving illusions and in turning back magical fire like a dragon's breath. My dog is doing crazy stuff. I don't know what the problem is. She's real antsy. Sorry. Uh, giant strength. Uh, instills tremendous power in your party, increasing their strike ability by 10. And finally, that's a party spell, huh? And then finally, this spell will turn an enemy to stone, but won't affect a creature already made of stone. All right, I guess that makes sense. Teach me. Katie, stop being weird. All right. I guess that's that. Uh, we'll exit, and I guess we got to go replenish our spell supply. I don't think any of the spells that we got are um, out of combat spells. I guess we could test here. Uh, all right, Omar got what? Your party? Nope. Uh, sorry, Omar. I will do that actually. Oh, I will not do that, apparently. I can't summon a sword out of combat. Who knew? Uh, okay. Anything else, Omar? Uh, no, not really. Does this last longer, I wonder? Alright, I will cast that. I will cast... Varsh the Magic Shield... I will cast our magic compass. I will cast levitation. All right, we're gonna restore. Yep, so heard that's fine. Okay, and anything to identify? Nope. All right, and we got thirty slots of or thirty slots filled. It may be wise at this point. Spend the 10,000 and deposit or store some items. Um, okay. 
that works gives us a little bit more and then we can also go into here and stack those all right so we have about half of our stuff for free we still have forty-five thousand cash monies which feels really solid um is there anything else i need to do i don't think so uh i mean everybody's at full health everybody's at full mana uh, only other thing we got to do is Marcus needs to sing a new song. Traveler's Tune. And we're going to have Marcus try to order the wine. Let's see. Did he get... He did not. So we need to actually go back. We want to get uh, Marcus to order the mead. Sure. And then... To order the wine. All right. And now when we look, he's got all nine. All right, cool. All right, folks, let's get back into the old battleation and clearing out. That is. Oh, I thought it said twenty mad. My God, that is a lot of mad dogs. Uh, we can hide in the shadows here and then defend. Oh, uh, the spider hit Marcus. I'm like, really? That is not what happened. Alright, this should be relatively straightforward. Attack, 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 attack. Alright, let's take an actual look at what's going on here. Six points from Grady. Three times uh, for 17 from El Cid. Marcus hit for five. Brian hit for three times as well now for 23 points of damage. That's that. And we found an unidentified item. Let's go to Sir Grady and identify it. He did it. It's a lamp. That's... I mean, I feel like that shouldn't be a thing that you have to do. Like, you you, you don't you don't know what a lamp is? I... Hmm. Uh, sure. We'll hide in the shadows again. I didn't see... What is my percentage in shadow hide? I guess I'll see next time I... Get a chance. All right, we're gonna go basically just after the orcs, straight up. Ninety-five percent chance. All right, we'll defend and defend, and Sir Grady killed one. El Cid killed one. Bunch of misses. Brian killed one. All right, uh, attack the orcs, attack the orcs, attack the orcs, attack the doge. All right. Sir Grady did one point of damage. It's a bit rough. Oh, El Cid got smacked for nine. And I got bit for six. B-A-B-A-A-A-B. Defend, sure. All right, this should be fine. Not too bad. All right, and now we're back here and we gotta figure out what we're doing next. I am so glad I don't have to map this out. I know I say it all the time, but the joy that I don't have to do this is still there. All right, so if we go this way. Did I make the right choice? I did not. I made the wrong choice. Sir, there is no fix. Okay. Alright. Apologies, we need to go this way. And then from here, yeah, that's, that's, that's it. Okay, nothing ate me in there, that's good. We finally get a wandering creature that wants to join us. Told you guys it exists. All right, we're going to move him to the back line, and now we'll actually have somebody who either buffs us or actually attacks and damages the enemy. It's going to be great. Uh, two orcs, three nomads, and four half orcs. That should be fine. Attack, attack. 
be hide dd yes all right killed an orc marcus hit a nomad for three killed the other orc all right we got three nomads and four half orcs i i didn't i didn't see what our magician did i apologize i missed it um nomad 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 and half orc defend defend all right we got a kill for sir grady El Sid smacked or got smacked by uh, nomad for 10. El Sid then retaliated for 15 killing him marcus hits for three the magician cast wither strike on a half orc but it didn't do anything and then Brian killed the other Nomad for 23. And then the Nomad hits Sir Grady. Eh. All right. I'm going to attack the Half Orc, the Half Orc, the Half Orc, the Nomad. Let's see. Oh. There we go. Hey, we got the Wither Strike on a half orc there. Not too bad. A B, A B, A A, A A. Alright, defend, defend, and let it go. There it is. The nomad is gone. Orc number one is gone. Orc number two is gone. Well, half orc and beautiful. Alright, nothing really came of that. What are we doing now? All right, we missed a spot over here. All right, now what? How do we get back to the teleporter? Okay, I think I... Oh, never mind. It's just literally straight in front of me. Apparently blind. Fine. We haven't gone in here yet. Eight spiders. That... Could be fun, or very bad. I didn't know. No increase in our uh, armor, or decrease in our armor class either. The last, yeah, you know, the last thing. This is a tad unfortunate. Ooh, we got Kyleran's Invisibility Spell on the party, which just massively buffed us right after I said no increase. Okay, that's, that's really good. Cast that more often, Magician. What are you doing? All right, we're just going to breeze through these, hopefully, pretty quickly. A lot of withering strikes I'm hearing going out. Okay. All right, so we... Oh, okay. Three swordsmen. Eh, I don't like the swordsmen as much. I uh, said so they mostly missed. So they stop missing. Okay, there goes our defense through the roof again. Sir Grady! Nope, El Sid just said, Sir Grady, we don't even need you, buddy. You stay in stealth. We don't want you around here. Alright. So, if we go down into this thing that we can't see, it teleports us and screws up our ability to know where we're at. So let's not do that. It's a single sorcerer. Oh no, whatever will we do? Immediately kill him, apparently. That is what we will do. An unidentified instrument. Interesting. Alright, see if you... Nope. Apparently we only get one chance at identifying stuff. Eh. <sighs> I suppose we don't get to ponder much of anything. Alright, three half orcs seems easy. Nobody is overly hurt right now, which is nice. A little bit on Sir Grady, a little bit on Marcus. I. Mm. A little bit on El Cid, a little bit on Brian. I mean, everybody's hurting a little bit. I think the zombies are probably the biggest threat. All right, let's see what we got. Ah, 
I mean, I don't think you're gonna wither a zombie. To be fair. Ew, the zombie groped us. I don't know how I feel about that. Uh, B, A, B. All right. So, Brian's attacking the zombies. El Cid is attacking the half orc. Uh, Marcus is attacking the half orcs, or those two first two are swapped, maybe. And then Sir Grady's attacking the zombie. And dead. El Cid was attacking the zombies. So, Brian's attacking the half orc. There it is. All right. Attack the orc. Attack the orc. Attack the half orc. Attack the half orc. I think we're going to be okay. I'm not sure. Let's see. I don't know why that thing, our magician, that thing, our magician hasn't cast the invis. There it is. The invisibility on us so we could just stand here and laugh at them as we beat them to death. Oh. Uh, A, B, A, B, A, 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 B, B, yes. All right. All right, half orc is dead. Now it's all the orcs all the time. Three orcs to go. Can we line up our attacks well enough? Looks like it. There it is. And we found a mace, which is not really impressive. All right, cool. Clearly this is the path that we need to take for exploratory purposes. What do you think the odds are that there's another shadow realm down here? Oh, three black widows though. All right. Uh, okay, six. Oh, it does have poison. Crap. All right. We got two kills. All right. Well, I'm going to let the poison tick for a while. Because it well actually maybe it, maybe I shouldn't let the well we'll see. Uh, essentially we'll let the poison take a little bit, but the heal that we have it's it's the flesh whatever spell. It's like a ten to forty heal on top of removing poison and I think insanity. So I'm gonna let it take a little bit. He's about forty points down right now to be honest. So I probably don't even have to do that, but eh, I'm gonna do it for argument's sake. I suppose. More mercenaries. Alright, got the invisibility spell out again. I'm gonna let him get under 40 points, I think. Oh, goody. Seems like it's a square. Nope. Mm. I'm apparently lost. Or I don't know what direction I'm facing. No? Really? I'm just gonna look. Dang it. Yeah, I did get turned around. How, what? Is there something in there that's spinning me around? Huh. Well, apologies. I, I failed. As epically as ever before. Alright, Merlin is gonna actually cast the... Well, I don't know. I don't know if I want Merlin to cast anything yet. You know what? Yeah, we do. We'll, we'll, we'll still go with the lesser one. That's five points versus seven. I don't think the distance is really an issue for us right now. I did absolutely fail my maneuverings there, though. Very disappointed in myself. So, just south of us... Oh, there is a door that we missed. There's a couple of doors that we missed. Alright, let's get the one on the other side of this room. 
Then we'll backtrack and go down. Magicians and mercenaries. That's not what I wanted to do. Ugh. Actually, hold on. Attack the mercenaries. Attack the mercenaries. Attack the mercenaries. Hide in the shadows and defend. Chances are the mercenaries are going to yeah, step forward and advance, and then we'll still be able to hit them. Which is exactly what happened. Uh, with a strike on... Oh, good. Marcus is old now. Good for him. And now the magician is also old. Their magician, not ours, I guess. Uh, alright. Attack, 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 and hit the magician. Killed one magician. Killed the other two things. Gonna advance. Okay, and just go for that Moida. Alright, Elsid is, uh, time. Marcus, Flesh, Restore, that's what it is, uh, Elsid. Oh, that was pretty weak. I'm gonna run from this. I'm not gonna run from this, apparently. I am going to fight this. That is okay. Uh, okay, attack, attack. Um, attack, hide. I'm going to cast a spell. It is going to be a war strike. It's going to be on the orcs and defend. Alright, one down, two down. Burn one, two, three, four, five, six, seven out of eight were killed. We have the invisibility spell. Um, attack the orc, attack the orc. Defend. I can't attack. I'm going to hide in the shadows again. Defend, defend, and yes. Oh, the sorcerer moved up. Okay. We're going to advance on him, though. And this should finish them pretty quickly. Yep, it did. Oh, what'd that say? An inscription on the wall reads, Golems are made of stone. I mean, this is true, and I was aware of that. Though there are golems that are made of other things. I've heard of flesh golems. I've heard of mud golems, clay golems. I mean, not necessarily solely made of stone. All right. Okay, we're almost done with this area. Which is pretty sweet. Oh, cool. More darkness. Okay. I heard me go through a door again. Um, I light up with the lamp. Use it. Okay. Oh, there was a trap in there that we didn't hit because we have levitation on, which is beautiful. What does this say? Uh, a great deal of slime on the walls. Okay, Black Widows. We know how this goes last time. They have the ability to poison. Hopefully they miss. We killed one. They did miss, and we just got the spell buff upgrade to our defense, which is good. All right, cool, cool, cool. And we see that Marcus is no longer the the number one. Oh, and, and Elsid went up to minus six. Did was wasn't uh, I don't know. Okay, nothing really going on here. All right, let's take a look at the uh, the old uh, journal. Alright, there, and then down. And then from that, I guess the only spot left, after we claim this one, 
is up this way. There's whatever's in this blob. I don't think there's anything here. I think this is maybe just... Oh, no, there is. We can go there and then up. Okay, so there's a few spots left. All right, cool. All right, well... Half orc, mad dogs, and wolves. Yeah, sure. That sounds like a party to me. Uh, hide in the shadows. Sounds good. Half orc is beaten up. Ooh, Brian got smacked pretty hard there. All right, attack. The half orc. The half orc. Actually, the wolf. The half orc and the wolf. All right, let's go for that. Couple of kills right off. Uh, it's double wolves down. I like it. And I like that invisibility. Having that magician along is really nice. And I don't know but I'm going to assume the Magician might have unlimited mana. Seems to be using it like crazy and not running out, so... That's my assumption. Could be totally wrong. With a strike on the the Doge. E -A -A -A. All right. Killed one of the Half-Orcs. Also killed the Doug. Brian killed another half orc. And let's finish off the doges. One, two, and done. 504 experience, and we're feeling pretty okay. Just gonna explore that. Oh, interesting. Uh, I wanna take a look. What are we looking at here? Okay, we're about 10.5k, give or take, away from the next level. Oh, except this is this is where the mages are a bit further away. About 5,000 off. Okay, good to know. Form of a skeleton. Defend, defend. Yes. Four magicians and one barbarian. Well, I'm not even going to hide for that one. Ah, oh, Sir Gritty didn't finish them, so... Attack. 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 And attack. Alright, defend. Defend. Barbarian dead. And magician dead. Alright, what are we looking at? I missed a thing on my way through, apparently. It's this one, right? Yes. All right. Magician, sorcerer, half. Rather, the second time I try to run away, and they're just like, <laughs> "No." Uh, let's hide in the shadows. Interesting. Um, fight. Attack the half orc, attack the half orc, attack the half orc, and kill the sorcerer, defend, defend. Dead sorcerer, half orc down, half orc down, and finish up the last three half orcs. It's guns to be great. There it is. All right, beautiful. Sweet, sweet, nice styles with a Z. All right, again. Probably no reason to fully clear everything out, but it's just part of me that wants to make sure that it happens. Oh okay. yeah. So straight up, uh, I am gonna attempt to run from that. I'm fine with this fight. Yep. As long as we're not getting hit for 27. Fight. A B A B A A A A. Ben. 
Go. <laughs> Works. Okay, and more half orcs. We are facing the orcish horde, no doubt, no doubt. Alright, what are we looking at? Right, we got slapped around a bit there. It wasn't enjoyable. Sir Grady could use a medium heal. Arcus is okay. He could use a little bit of a heal. As could El Cid. Swordsman and two nomads. Attack, attack, attack. Hide, defend, defend. Alright. Swordsman number one dead. Swordsman smack Brian. Swordsman number two dead. Nope, not dead. Apologies. Okay. Um, attack B. Attack B. Attack A. And attack B. Alright. Defend, defend. And let's go. Sir Grady... I guess didn't hide. I, and I didn't notice. Apologies. He's got like a 90% chance. I don't even think that it's possible for him to fail. But 90% is not 100%. I know this is a, re a, a, re a revelation for you. A revelation for you all. But Okay... All right, okay. Door again. So we're gonna go left now, we're, we're facing west. One, two, three, three. Facing south. We're facing east. Now we're facing west. We're facing north. Okay, east. Now we're facing north. There, oh, there's stairs here. Uh, not yet. I would like to see what I'm I'm doing here. Okay, it looks like there's one spot that we missed. I'm gonna check that, and I'm gonna go to the stairs. I I guess. Watch it be trapped. Uh, no. Yeah, we'll, we'll take the stairs in a second. I'm just gonna check. Oh, it actually was trapped. That's, that's fantastic. Alright, to the stairs. I guess we'll go to level 2 briefly. I'm gonna try... Mark, uh, sorry, Omar's... Ability to see stuff with this. Merlin is going to flesh restore onto Brian. Omar is going to quick fix. Oops. Is going to quick fix. On to Sir Grady. And we're going to try to roll with that. How much time do we have left with our spells? Not that much, but a little bit. Well, welcome to uh, floor two. Floor sewers level two. Very cool. We fully uh, explored the other sewer, which is nice. Oh. Um, okay. This doesn't seem that much more terrifying. Okay. So Grady jumped into the shadows. The Barbarianios said it advanced, as did the Dogs of Madness. Zombie 1, Zombie 2. Alright, Barbarians take precedence. Now we'll see how that goes. One down, two down, three down. And Marcus got a hit. Yeah, please cast the invisibility spell. Thank you. All right. One, two. We'll, we'll just all in on uh, these boys. Okay, I think 
the first two are going to attack the mad dogs, and then the other two are going to finish off the barbarian. Alright, that's fine. Two dogs down. Barbarian's still alive. A, B, A, B, A, 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 D, D. Alright, so same thing. Sir Grady and, I'm sorry, uh, Brian and El Cid are attacking the dogs. Marcus and Sir Grady are attacking the barbarian. Another dog down, another dog down. And Marcus took down the barbarian. And the last two doges, we said good day. All right. Ah, sure, why not? Four nomads and two nomads. Ah, that seems fine. Hide. Uh, attack, 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 attack the other group, one down, two, three down, and the last one is down, alright, cool, what are we looking at now, uh, we haven't closed too much distance on our level there, a little bit closer, still got a ways to go, I already did that, but just being a little bit diligent in a very, ooh, ineffectual way. Hmm. It's going to take us a while, but I, I don't really see this being too big of a problem. Especially if we get lucky enough to get the old invisible on us, we do not. We are not defensive at all here. We're just getting chomped on by the spiders. There we go. Alright, it's going to take us a little bit, but let's burn through this as quickly as we can. I mean, nothing super exciting is happening here. We're all spamming our basic attacks at the spider. And that's it. Brian got the kill. 325 experience later. Alright, uh, don't know much about the surrounding area, really. Alright, what do you think? You think this is shadowy? Oh, I don't like the Black Widows. Nope, it's not shadowy. Nice. I am opting to run from certain fights to, like, prolong my own life, basically. Um, yeah, I think we can do this. Maybe, 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 maybe. And go. Alright. We're gonna attack the Skeleton. The Skeleton. The skeleton. And then we're gonna hide. Defend. And now we're just gonna go crazy and kill the swordsman. There's one down and two down. Not bad. And okay, nothing terrible happens waiting for a teleporter or something else to get me there. Pleasantly surprised that it was kind of innocuous. Oh. Uh, it's kind of inconvenient. Nope, apparently I'm fighting it. Um, hey, sure. Attack, attack, attack. Hide in the shadows. Cast your wither, your war strike on the magicians, I guess. And defend. Yes. Okay, nomad hit us. We killed one, we killed two, we killed three, we killed four, and we killed a nomad, and we now have invis or, sorry, invisibility, so we're harder to hit, and that's, yeah, we're, we're good. Okay, and the wolves, as uh, Mutanot would say, or for the rest of us, the wolves. Okay, one dead wolf. And here should be all dead wolves. There it is. A mandolin, or a mandolin, as it were. Mm. Alright, well, I'll say it almost looks like we've sealed off this area, but not quite. I 
That seems fine. All right, we have to break out the episode here soon. Uh, Nomad down. Zombie down. Three times, 32 points damage. Really, really good. And yeah, we'll just fight bravely here. Attack, 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 attack. Defend, defend. And one down from the ambush, one down from just the nasty swing. That's all we needed. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I think I am going to break it off there. This is the little chunk that we have now uncovered in the sewers too. And apparently something on the left, because again, we're in a Pac-Man world, living our Pac-Man lives. Uh, yeah, going pretty well. Uh, let's take a quick peek at our overall, about 7,000 away for the melee boys, but the magic folk are still quite a bit away. They're still, what, like 12,000 away? Something like that. So it's going to be a bit before we hit level 10 with our mage, uh, our conjurer, and our magician. But that's okay. Um, I'm hoping we find some better equipment. We've, we've found a lot of pretty basic equipment so far. So I'd like to find, like, another mithril sword, for instance. That would be fantastic. I would really like that. Please, please, please give me more of that. But we'll see. Anyway, folks, I've been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show. We play, we fight, we conquer.